There's two things I like about your dumbbell row at the moment. Firstly, you're lowering the dumbbell all the way down, completely lengthening out the arm. Many people make the mistake of cutting that range short. And the second thing, I can see you're trying to make an effort at rowing the elbow back to get the most out of your back muscles, as opposed to just rowing the dumbbell directly straight up, probably just incorporating more bicep. So great job, keep doing these two things. Now there is a couple of things I'm gonna invite you to try and do. So firstly, it does look like you're trying to row that dumbbell a little bit too high to the point where the upper arm goes completely past the rib cage. As I've learned from Paul Carter, Coach Kasim, Eric Cressy, the lat is pretty much responsible for the upper arm to finish roughly in line with the rib cage, and anything else beyond that is just other stuff, and it may even aggravate the bicep tendon. So instead, Let's just finish with the upper arm roughly in line with the rib cage. You can go just a little bit past, but we don't want to over exceed that range of motion. The second thing, it does look like you're a little bit hunched over with your tailbone tucked underneath you. So instead, let's think about straightening out, getting a bit more neutral, and this should be a much stronger position for you to perform your one arm dumbbell row. So let's start there. Thank you for sending me a video. Hope you found this helpful.